Aquarius. Welcome to your weekly reading for January 16th, 2020. Please show me what Sagittarius needs to know here or see. Thank you. And here's your first card. Queen of Coins in the reverse. Someone is upset. Someone could be mad. Someone is is feeling short of money and it's making this could be you or this could be someone this could be an earth sign um, Taurus Virgo Capricorn this person they might be asking you for money but they're very upset or mad magician in the reverse they they might be unwell they might not be feeling very good. Um, something that they were trying to get off the ground, it's not happening. They might feel like they're having a lot of bad luck. They could be feeling mentally ill. But whatever they're trying to do, it's, it's, not, it's not happening. And they're getting very, very upset. They could be getting scared. In your why, you have the Ace of Coins in the upright. So someone is, is very, very happy and blessed. Feeling very abundant, new beginning, money coming. Um, this might be a message to you that if you're if you're waiting if you're feeling very very broke and you feel like you're having some really crappy luck right now um, I think that there's there's money coming to you there's I just heard the word settlement um, or you could have bought something and put a down payment and now you're feeling broke it could be it as well you might regret it you might regret spending your money somewhere. Someone might feel tricked. This can be someone manipulating situations or you could just be kind of worried. Let's see how you feel. Rest in the reverse. Okay, well, I feel like you are taking a rest right now. I feel like you're um, saving your energy for your future when you're you know you're gonna need it um, that's also right beside well this end of the card is called bag of money there's no bad end of ace of coins it's it's good both ways um, but this is being perfectly happy so I think part of what this is saying because this is this can mean that well everything is is reversed here not not the coin but it, I'm feeling some really heavy, heavy energy here. Um, like this is like a low vibration. This is kind of feeling broke or mad or upset or worried. Um, and this is taking time off. This is a very, very psychic card, a very intuitive card. And I feel like you're kind of giving it a rest. This is about being perfectly content, perfectly happy. So I think You're trying to raise your vibration. You're trying to turn this around because this is manifesting when it's in the upright. So we're gonna see what it's pointing at in a minute. But I feel like you're okay. But yes, you might be broke, but you're actually just conserving energy because you're, you know you're gonna need it coming up. And you're going to get a lot of money in the near future. Something to do with your intuition, something to do with your, um, also your silence. This is not saying anything. I feel like you're hibernating, Sagittarius. That's what this feels like. You're being a mushroom, but you're fine. You could be waiting for this. You could be knowing it's, it's coming. Um, you could be trying to manifest it, actually. I see this magician in between 
you holding your hand out waiting for the coin and the magician in between the coin and the, blah, blah, between the two coins but it's happening too slow but you're being patient you're laying low you're not saying anything in your advice you have the five of coins in the reverse so this is things feeling out of order um this could mean someone is you know trying to i don't know slow this down it it feels like someone's getting in between you and the money that is owed to you and trying to create disorder. So your advice is the opposite. The, your advice is to create order out of disorder. This is also change five. This is feeling um, left out when it's in the upright and it's also called the other woman down there um someone's going to feel left out or someone's going to be singled out in your future it could be someone that could be who's doing this to you there could be someone that's um they feel left out someone feels left out by you i was going to say virgo um Someone feels left out by you. This is getting in touch with your spirituality and also I'm feeling like maybe you want to do some kind of um, cleansing. Like have a cleansing bath maybe. Let's see what the bottom of the deck is. Ten of Wands. Treason. Someone's trying to take your money. Someone's trying to create burdens, obstacles. Obstacle is right beside the other woman. So I don't know what, if that means something to you, if there's a woman in your life who, well, this, this is referring to um, another woman in a three-party situation. So I don't see a three-party situation in the reading, but just the way these are all coming up, somebody being left out, um, someone's definitely going to feel singled out in the future and, or maybe they already are, and they're creating obstacles for you. Someone is trying to get in between you and your money right here. And also you have treason right beside bag of money. I think someone's trying to lower your vibration Wow, this reading went all over the place, Sagittarius. This could be a Gemini. Could be a Gemini that is um, this other person. Someone trying to leave you out in the cold, trying to confuse you. But I really think you're hanging on. You're hanging on to, you're conserving energy and you're hanging on to this being perfectly happy no matter what happens while you're hibernating, while you're trying to get through some kind of money situation, trying to get the money that is owed to you, I think. All right, I love you guys. And your shuffle song is called Sunday Love. All right, love you, bye.